Oh. I was going I was going to go sleep in the bed and wait till night, but apparently Henya has something to say. She cares? What about the ones in the pot? Anyway. Henya. These past two days, I swear I hear a voice every time I walk past the bedroom and the, <laughs> the restroom at night. Who in the world is in there? I just wish they'd pipe down. Ugh. Well, maybe you should go to bed like normal people do during the night. Grandma. Anyway, welcome back to another Pal Plays The Legends of the Skyward Sword. In the last two episodes, we've done a bunch of side questy stuff, and this is hopefully the last episode we'll have to do so for a while. Let's go ahead and sleep in Fledge's bed because apparently moved in. Oh, and yeah, don't read anything about what I said last episode about him spying on us. I didn't mean anything more than that. I'm just saying he was spying on us. Okay. What is this? What is this? What is that thing? A wind up thing? What is that? It's weird. Anyway, let's. He has a bright colored room, I'll give him that. It's a cool room. And I'm, I'm recording at a way different time of the day than I normally. I normally record maybe about 6.30, 7 at night. And right now I'm recording at 4. I've done, I've done it in the, in the past, but I just... Uh, I just failed miserably and decided I'm just going to record at night. Anyway, let's talk to Fletch. 5, 6, 7... Will he we ever activate this quest? Okay. Wait. Uh do we have we do. We have stuff to give him. Huh. Okay, we want to be here at night because we are doing one of two things. We are going to activate the uh there are two branches to the letter side quest. The letter being this. One one branch is where we use it as scrap paper, give it to the to the person in the bathroom, and the other branch is where we give it to Karain. Now I let I want to do the Karain branch as the main branch of the story, but I'm showing this first. So let's go ahead and give it to the person in the bathroom. Can, can't go in. Ah, paper! You've brought me some paper. I'll open the door. Please come in. Okay. I've never been invited into a bathroom before. And there's a hand in the toilet. People who've played Majora's Mask are probably familiar with this. Or Link's Awakening? I believe. No, not Link's Awakening. Is it Link's Awakening or Oracle of Ages or Seasons? I know it's one of those games. Okay, let's talk to it. Ooh, paper. I need paper. I'm not angry at or anything. I just need some paper. Here you go. Huh? You're giving me paper? I'm so happy. But this looks like someone's letter. Are you sure I can have this? Yeah, you can have it. Thank you. I will use it with care. But I'm shy, so don't ask me what I want the paper for. May we meet again, you kind soul. That was creepy. Man, my ear's still poppy. That sounds weird, but it is. Ugh. Let's go in here. No, not fledge. Actually, we won't sleep till morning. Man, I, I don't like how there's no music, and can we... What, what do you have to say? Oh, wait! You have something different to say! He said something different. wonder what that means. Until morning. And while this happens, I will stop recording audio and try to get my ear... There. <laughs> Sound kind of uh, that was kind of awkward, but uh, it's so annoying. It feels like someone has a can over my ear. I'm still dealing with this. It's from an ear infection I had like last month. Ugh. 
talk to Colin. Hey, Link, did you hand over that letter like I asked? Huh? What? What letter? You... You... Are you out of your mind? Seriously, you gave it to that creep in the restroom? Really? You gave it to that restroom weirdo? Didn't I specifically tell you not to give it to the weirdo in the restroom? Seriously, I said I said it like five times. I know I did. <laughs> you fool! How could you? Anyone who blocks the path of true love deserved be deserves to be kicked by a bird. I hate you, Link. This is why I don't. Let's talk to him. Where'd he go? In Gruce's room. Well? What do you want, Link? I'm just, I'm just hurting so bad right now. I don't know who that was in the restroom, but I'm completely freaked out just knowing that they read my letter. What if it was Crane? I still can't even believe it. Who exactly did, did you give it to? <laughs> About that. Gave it to someone who lives in the toilet. Uh, I, don't, I don't think you have to worry about them coming out, because they probably can't fit. Where... Oh, yeah. No, we want to go to Fledge's room. Fledge. We, we're going to sleep till night. Both branches give you uh, gratitude crystals, but... It, it's kind of up to you whether you want to do what he wants or give it to the person in the restroom. <sighs> you. You should be ashamed of yourself. I wonder if we have to upgrade the potion. Where are we going? Oh yes, Gruce's room. I A couple episodes I said, and I'm going to be interrupted again by dialogue. In fact, here it is. It's a disembodied hand. It wasn't someone who... It wasn't a, a person that lived in the, in the toilet. It was a ghost. <laughs> Help. Ah, you're the one from the other day. It's good to see you again. Actually, thanks to you... I met my true love. Yes, him. It all started with that letter you gave me. Those beautiful words of affection caused me to fall hopelessly, hopelessly in love. Ah, my heart is bursting with thoughts of him. I feel so excited, so cheerful, so full of life. The gratitude crystals from her. Got five gratitude crystals. Yeah. Poor, poor guy. 39. Ah, my love. I'll always be by your side. Teehee. <laughs> okay, we can't target the hand. Oh, man, I should have targeted the hand. And had Fee say something. Oh, wait, I can. This is the hand. This is the hand of a ghost. Identity while alive is unknown. Judging from the look of this hand, the probability that it was a young girl's is ninety percent. Master, the letter you gave her from Colin has inspired feelings for him. The ghost's original purpose for the letter is still unclear. That's another thing. I am no longer doing my voice for Fee because I. Zade did say that it was terrible, and. I listened to it in recording, and I, I I agree, it was pretty awful. So, that's probably one of the last times I'll be using that. I, I'm not sure if it, that's a good thing or bad. Say it in the comments. Let's go ahead, and actually we're going to quit. So, I'll be right back with the other branch, the official branch of... Well, not the official, but the official for this LP, the branch for the thing. Okay, be back. Hmm. 
And we're back. So for the good for good branch of the storyline, I believe we have to talk to Pippet. I think. Hey Link, you're pr looking pretty up. Oh wait. Hey Link, you're looking pretty upbeat today. That's the spirit. Zelda will be. No, it's not it. Okay, we must talk to Karain. That's probably it. I believe she's out here. And off screen, I got a couple bugs. I got one. Uh, actually, no, I didn't get a Skyloft. A Skyloft pincer beetle or whatever it is. But I did get a couple Blissed butterflies. Where is Karain? She in her, I'm, I bet she's in her room. That that makes sense. Probably as soon as this quest activated, she went to her room to hide from the quest. So, uh, two episodes ago, two I think two, I think two. Um, I mentioned that there are some changes that I made to the channel, and then I didn't mention what changes. Where's Karain? Oh, I know where she is. There are some. I mentioned that there are some changes to the channel. You won't really notice them right off. There, there's a one small one. I think I, I think I was able to make the border around the right side of the video, the right side, right there, smaller because there's kind of some black letterboxing. I'm still working on that. It's it's a process. And anyway, as I was saying, I made some changes. Look at the description. That's different. Also. That episode that I said, eh, I don't want to annotate the videos because I'm I'm lazy, but I'll try anyway. <laughs> that day, I annotized every single video that hadn't been annotized or put the annotations on. So that's that's done, and it was so so easy. <sighs> oh, Pippet, why? Uh, how can I get you to notice me? Ah, oh. oh, Link. Uh, what's the matter? Do you uh need something? I wonder if he heard what I was just talking about. Give the letter, don't give the letter. Give the letter, don't... No! Huh? You're a strange one, aren't you, Link? Uh, <laughs> I'm glad you noticed. I am a strange one. <laughs> that was funny. Also, ra random thing. Okay, she's wearing... Oh, huh? A letter? For me? Could it be from Pippet? Here you go. We, we don't answer. Oh, thank you. I'll just take that. I wonder who it's from. Whoa. That's some really terrible handwriting. Anyway, never mind that. Let's see what it says. Please open it. Okay, good. Greetings. My love... <laughs> you know love letter's bad if it starts out with greetings. <laughs> Greetings. My love for you is wider than the horizon and deeper than the clouds. That's so cliche. Sheesh. I would very much like it if you would go out with me. Your brave knight, Colin. That was horrible. Why did the hand... Why did that disembodied hand... Wow. Why did that disembodied hand take an interest? That's a horrible love letter. Dot, dot. Dot, 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 I think I got all of them. Wow, this Colin guy, isn't he one of Groose's flunkies? And this, this is a love letter that from that Colin kid, right? Who boy. So, yeah, I have to say, he really put his heart into it and everything. I don't know, maybe I should consider going out with Colin. Ha! As if. Sigh. Er, ha. Uh, <laughs> I wonder what Pippet would think if he if he knew about this. Hmm. <laughs> Me walking into a wall as I'm distracted by something. Uh, upstairs. To upstairs. Oh wait, no. Let's talk to Colin. Well, that is that. Is there a third branch if we talk to Colin? What? You actually did it? You gave the letter to Karain? Oh no. Oh no! What now? What do I do? Maybe I should go see what she thought of the letter. Ah, uh, but this this is so embarrassing. Hmm. Let's go talk to Pippet. Come on, Romeo. So anyway, yeah, the, it, just the description, and um, of course I put annotations on all the videos, including this one. So, I'll be doing that consistently now, from now on. Hey, Pivot. What's up, Link? Huh? 
Corrine got a love letter. I I see. That's interesting. Wow. Or, um, what, what do you think she intends to do? <laughs> Beats me. No, literally. If I if I ten if I presume to understand anything about a girl, she'd probably beat me up. So you don't know. Well, that's gonna bother. That's going to bother me till I find out. Oh, I mean, uh, it's not like there's anything going on between me and Karain, you know. We're just friends. That's what they all say, buddy. So it's it's not my business. Who, uh, it's not my business who she goes out with. I don't uh, I don't have much to say about it. But you know, I do have a duty to make sure that everyone is living to the high ideals of our night school, right? I mean, ideal love is unfettered and passionate. Anything anything less than that can't really be called love at all. You know what I mean? So I should just I should just step in and make sh and make sure that she's found a true love that aspires to the highest ideals of our fine educational institution, right? Man, that's that's a sentence right there. How did he say that in one text box? Oh, text text boxes represent breaths, by the way. So they all say it in one breath. And what about me? I have a right to experience an unfettered and passionate love, too, don't I? You understand, don't you, Link? I'm not wrong about this, am I? Uh... <laughs> I don't know. I I'm gonna say this. I'm, I'm more interested in saying that. You like her? What? What? Don't be ridiculous, Link. I don't even understand how you could make such a wild ac accusation. Well, either way... I don't suppose you'd mind a mind asking her what decision what her decision is going to be, would you? <laughs> Back to Juliet. Oh wait. We're Yeah. Horwell Crane. Yeah. Oh wait, no, she's not in here. <laughs> I forgot. Okay, we're cutting back and forth. Seriously. Oh boy. You're the one who sent the letter, right? Y yes. <laughs> it was a wonderful love letter. Thank you. That wasn't a l that wasn't wonderful. It wasn't that great. My feelings exactly. And um what well, what's your answer? You don't ask that. My answer? Oh, my answer. Oh, please. Please go out with me. Hey. Wait. Fight. I think that you should go out with me instead. I mean, er, I want to ask you out. What? Hey, hold on there. What are you trying to pull all of a sudden? Er... I want to go out with Pippet. Yay! <laughs> ha, see that, you fool? I knew she would choose me. She's been checking me out for weeks. Uh, wait a second. Wait, really? Shove him out of the way. Truly? You choose me? Yes, I'm so happy. Thank you. <laughs> both both route, routes or routes are just heartache for Colin. Uh, this can't be happening. Ah! <laughs> oh my word! His scream, Link. I am suddenly super manly, and I'm Batman. When I told you about the letter, it was at that moment I finally realized. I realized that. I, I I love her. I thought to myself, I can't let anyone else take her from me. You should have stabbed Colin with your sword in the hair. No, seriously, stabbed his hair. If you hadn't told me, I might have never noticed my own feelings for her. I'm so grateful. I don't know what I can, how I can ever thank you. Graduate Crystal. And now we can go see Batro and be done with...
all of these things, all of these, uh, well, not all of them. We can be done with most, with the side quests for now. I wasn't sure what I was saying. <laughs> Thanks, Link. Because of you, I have an amazing new boyfriend. But I kind of feel bad about Colin, you know? You can make it out for them. Maybe you could go on, like, a double date. Like, maybe he could go out with the item check girl, and then you'd go out with Pippet, and then, actually, triple date. I'll go out with Zelda, you go out with Pippet, Colin will go out with the item check girl. Okay, but I'm fine with that. Hey, Link, thanks to you, I have a wonderful, uh, I have a, I found a wonderful girlfriend. Thank you so much. So they say the same thing, basically, and also... Oh. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That says Karain plus Colin. Wow. That's that's a good touch. No running the halls. I'll run if I want. Actually, I can't run inside. So we're going to go see Batro and get a ton of money. Because we only have 86... Actually, you know what we're going to do? We're going to drink a potion right now. Go buy a potion because we're going to need it. Yeah, we're going to need it. And so we're going to drink a potion. And I get, get show off what stamina potions do. They slow down your stamina meter from depleting. If you upgrade them, you can... I'm not sure if you can use them multiple times, but it'll stop it completely from depleting at all. So you can run forever. Well, forever. It, as long as forever is three minutes. So that's pretty cool. I really wish we got these were available in Laneru. Uh, where are we going? Oh yeah, potion. We could use one of these. Oh, we can't get it, man. We can't get the potions when we need them. I have a problem with this stat establishment. Okay, here. And. Yep, we'll get one, and we'll, we can, can we upgrade it? I'm not sure if we have enough. When we go between episodes, not this episode, but probably between next episode, I will go get a bunch of bugs from Farron. Yes, humble side business. Yes, I do. Let's upgrade the stamina one if we can. We can't. We can do this one. That's nice. Okay, let's go see Batro. <laughs> Again, I say, uh, you know, I say that we're not going to show me stocking up, and then we do it. Do that. No, I don't. Let's go. Run away. Leave me alone. Where's the skip button when you need it? Okay, let's go. Go see Batro. So we're going to the graveyard, and yes, we can. I believe we can reach it in the day. 90% sure. So let's cut over to Batro. And here we are. Let's run on in. And man, that stamina potion was useful. Not, re not really. I could have gone. I couldn't gone by without it. Also, what does Fee have to say about you? This is Batro, or Beatrix. <laughs> Beatrix. A kind-hearted demon. Though he's a, he is menacing in appearance, he displays not only ex not he, uh, he displays only extremely friendly behavior towards humans. Now that I'm not doing the fee voice, it's messing me up. If I did that in fee voice, I wouldn't mess up. Okay, let's get some stuff. Oh, you gathered quite a lot of gratitude crystals, haven't you? How magnificent! Please take this as a, a token of this demon's deepest appreciation. Medium wallet. That's nice, because we have a lot now. Oh, gracious me, that is a prodigious quantity of gratitude crystals you brought for me. This is such an appallingly insufficient reward that make that my cheeks burn hot with embarrassment. But please, take this. That's not small. That's amazing. Although, if he's technically a demon, he must have... He's... Hearts must be on the menu, I guess. Oh, wow. That completed a heart container, too. Wow. Sweet. <laughs> More Projibish gives things. Gold rupee? No. 
Wow, another wallet. Hopefully it'll give us some rupees to go along with this wallet. Please have one more. Okay, treasure chest. But, let's talk to him. What, what's with the treasure chest, buddy? I want to be human so badly it pains me. Please hurry and gather more gratitude crystals. Next, come and see me when you've gathered 40 of the... 40? Really? We have what, 39? We have 39! Uh. No, I beg you, stop. That chest is not to be opened under any circumstances. There is something unspeak uh, unspeakable un inside. But I want to open it. I said no! That chest contains the inf infamous evil of the dreaded cursed metal. If you carry that metal with you, you'll find more rupees than ever before. You'll even have better chances of finding treasure. You'll... you'll... oh, don't make me say it. Say what? It gets worse. Far worse. As if finding rupees and treasures is bad enough. It also... Any poor soul who holds that metal will find himself unable to open his pouch! No matter how badly you want to use your potions or shields, they'll be denied to you. Can you imagine a more gruesome fate? Please push any thought of this chest out of your mind forever. You must never think of it again. Wait, what, what was that that you just did? That was creepy. That sound he made. Sound like bones breaking. So we're gonna open it anyway. And we get the cursed metal. Rupees and treasure will appear more often, but it still carries a curse that prevents your pouch from opening. Eek! Now, I'm, I'm pressing the minus button to open my thing. Not working. So, I'm not sure if we equip a shield, then put a treasure medal in, if it will still be able to use the shield. If we can, I might consider you using it. But for now, we're not going to use it simply because we have awesome shields, and... We want to use them and mix up our game. So we're going to do that. So that is going to be it if, if for the next episode. For this episode. Next episode, we're going below the clouds. No doubt about it. We are going down below the clouds. And we're going to see one of the trials that they talked about. And hopefully get one of those gifts. 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 I'll see you next episode. Which is two days for you. A couple minutes or seconds for me. Okay. Bye-bye.